Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So today I am here to share with you guys my very first ever on my channel a wig video. So if you've been watching my channel for a while, then you probably know I'm not really into wigs. I like the versatility that they give, but I just feel completely uncomfortable wearing wigs. Y'all know these new headband wigs have been going all around YouTube and I've been intrigued because I am a lazy girl when it comes to hair and I want something quick and easy. And that is what these wigs promise. Also, just to mention, when I first moved to the city where I live, I didn't have a hairstylist. And so I used to buy half wigs, synthetic cheap half wigs back in the day. You know, I was in college. <laughs> And uh, I used to buy those and wear a headband on them. So it makes me feel very nostalgic that now these headband wigs are coming out because they're basically like half wigs. However, the one that I picked up is human hair. So this should be a lot, a lot more of an upgrade than what I used to buy. So before we get into the wig unboxing, let me quickly introduce myself if you've never watched a video here. My name is Aisha. I make videos about fragrance, beauty, luxury, and lifestyle. If those are things that you're interested in, then please make sure you go ahead and subscribe now. And if you are a returning subscriber, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and thanks so much for tuning in again. So, I purchased this wig off good old Amazon. And the reason I did is because I didn't want to spend a lot of money because I'm very fickle when it comes to wigs. I purchased some and just never end up wearing them. So I didn't want to spend a lot of money and some of these can be pretty steep because you're talking about human hair. I was hoping, I'm gonna be completely transparent with y'all, I was hoping a wig company would reach out to me <laughs> and offer me a wig to try. Companies like that used to always reach out to me and I never wanted to try them. So now when I actually wanna try a wig, like nobody reaches out to me. But anyway, I went ahead and paid for this with my own money, purchased it off Amazon, and it's from the company called Julia Hair. I will link the exact one I got down below. Um, so open it up. So in the box, this is the hair. It looks like it came with one headband. So I'll just try on with this headband for today's sake. Also came with some lashes in this cute little case. So I'm gonna take the lashes out of this case, but I'm actually gonna use this case for something else. So that's cool. I, I'm not gonna wear those lashes though. And then it also came with a wig cap, which I'm very happy about because I have one wig cap but I don't know where it is right now, so yeah. Now, I know y'all are probably thinking, how are you gonna put this wig on over your hair? So right now, my hair is currently in a twist out, uh, kind of a big twist out. Um, typically, if I was gonna wear this, I would actually do flat twists all the way back for my hair. I don't know how to braid or cornrow, so that's what I typically do when I need to tie my hair back. Uh, but for the sake of this video, and just to quickly try this wig on, we are just going to uh, make it work, honey. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't look too puffy, uh, but I think because it's actually a twist out, it should lay down pretty easily. So let's see. So I just realized I don't even have a ponytail holder with me, y'all. All my ponytail holders are upstairs. So we are just gonna pop this wig over all my hair <laughs> and stuff it up in here. I'm thinking because of the type of wig it is i don't think it'll be a problem but like i said if i was actually you know going to wear this wig out somewhere today i would go ahead and twist my hair down because to do flat twists on like stretch hair like it is now it would only take me like 10 minutes but yeah so here we are with my wig cap on i am going to go ahead and lay my edges just a tiny bit um just so we can kind of get a true picture of how this wig is going to look so for my edges i'm going to be using this gorilla snot gel i don't use this very often but it's downstairs here in my beauty room so that's what we're using <laughs> If I were actually gonna be wearing this wig out, I would definitely like tie a scarf around my edges. 
um, to help my baby hairs lay down. But like I said, I'm just trying this on and I'm literally gonna take it right back off. So <laughs> let's go ahead and open up the hair. So, oh, it looks like they gave me another scarf too, or another headband too, so that's cute. These headbands are actually pretty cute. But of course you can use any headband you want. So this is what the wig looks like. I'm gonna try it on straight out of the package, but right off the bat, I can tell you there is a smell to it. So before I actually like wear, wear this, I would wash it a little bit. Um, so if y'all have any tips on how to get the body wave back once you wash hair, let me know, cause I'm, I'm really not sure about that. Um, but it comes with two clips on the inside. So one large clip down here and then one large clip up here. So that's it. And then of course the headband portion here that Velcro's in the back. So I think I'm going to try to apply it from the back. And I, <laughs> All right, try again. I'm going to try, now try to apply it from the front because that did not work. <laughs> Okay, so that is it on initially. I have not tied the headband yet. I did adjust my um, cap a little bit, push a little bit farther back because I felt like it was pulling once I clipped those clips in. So um, you just wanna make sure anytime you're putting a wig on or anything, it should be comfortable. If you feel like you're having tension on your hair, um, if you're feeling tension when you first apply it, then imagine what that's gonna be like for your hair. So um, just a tip. So now I just need to secure the Velcro portion in the back. So it just snaps into place like that. So now my wig is on. I personally feel like I like to see my edges a little bit. So yeah, there we go. Got a little bit of edges out, and now we got this beautiful hair. Uh, it is dark. It took me a long time to commit to one of these because it's really hard to find a colored wig. I prefer a colored wig. This is not colored, but I didn't want to spend a lot of money on a colored wig until I you know, tried this out and see if it was actually going to work for me. So um, yeah, I really like it, but it's different seeing myself with dark hair, but I do like it. I think it goes on my skin tone. Sorry, I'm looking in my mirror back there, y'all. <laughs> And the hair feels really, really soft. Um, this is supposed to be body wave. I don't know about that. <laughs> I like the wave that it has to it. Um, and I think it looks relatively natural, but it probably could be touched up a little bit as far as making it a more like uniform wave pattern, if y'all know what I mean. But I do really like it. So there we are with just the wig on. I'll show you what it looks like in the back. Now remember, I did not do a, uh, I did not braid my hair down, but I actually think it works because of the body of the hair. Um, it doesn't, I don't see that big hump <laughs> that I can get because of my hair, you know? So that's what it looks like with just the black headband. Um, so you could wear it like this. And then you could also use one of the headbands that they included or your own headband. So the one I'm gonna put on is this blue one. So I have to say, this is super cute, y'all. Super cute, I love it. I really, really love it. Um, I'm super excited to play around with this some more. Like I said, I am gonna wash it. Um, so hopefully I can get it, hopefully after I wash it, I won't lose all my curls, but 
because it's human hair I can curl this and I read all the reviews on Amazon to see if it was actual real human hair um because you know people try to play you <laughs> And all the reviews were saying, you know, I tried burn test, blah, blah, blah. And they were saying it was real, so I trust their opinion. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm super happy with this. I feel like the density is perfect. I like the length. Only if I could change anything, I would change the color. But I actually think it's really cute and just gives me like a different fun look. <laughs> so yeah, you'll probably be seeing this in some videos when I want to switch it up, <laughs> which is pretty much all the time. So yeah i love it i'm super excited to play around with this i know you can also style these wigs so if you wanted to do like a top ponytail you could um honestly i don't have any ponytail holders but if we wanted to just take a look see that's kind of give you an idea um that you could put it up like in a top knot like that i personally probably would never do that just because I don't know if I want to put my hair in a ponytail I'll probably just do it with my real hair but that's definitely an option so yeah I'm very excited to play around with this wig more if you guys have tried any headband wigs and you have any suggestions for me how to take care of this wig <laughs> then please leave those down below um, thank you guys so much for watching I'll see you in my next video bye